The 60s were an interesting decade for cars. Sports cars didn't have much to talk about. The speeds were painfully sluggish, the designs were too boxy, and the performance was extremely questionable. But in a good way, this was the golden era for sports cars. In that respect, coming up with this list was completely based on performance, speed, design, and influence. Of course, there were other great cars produced in this decade. While some have literally disappeared from memory, some are still talked about today. These are our top 10 sports cars of the 1960s. Number 10. The 1966 Lamborghini Miura With a V12 1,929cc engine that could burst out 262 pounds per foot of torque and 350 horsepower, the 1966 Miura is still considered one of the most beautifully designed cars to date. The car had a certified top speed of 170 miles per hour, but critics worried about the little braking strength and the uncomfortable lift from the front side. Number 9. The 1960 Ferrari 250 GT LWB This sports car was the closest it came to reliving the memorable Spider from Ferris Bueller. The 250 GT came with a 3-liter V12 engine that could pump out 296 horsepower. It could achieve a maximum speed of 145 miles per hour, mostly because of short gearing. Number 8. The 1969 Maserati Ghibli Spider The Maserati Ghibli Spider was inspired by the Daytona Ferrari, but is even rarer than the stunning fastback coupe. The model was purchased in 20 copies only and differed from the previous car in terms of visual appearance and lightness. Notable specs included a V8 4719 engine that could achieve 335 horsepower and a limited speed of 154 miles per hour, the best speed in the world for a luxurious Grand Tourer at that time. Number 7. The 1963 Porsche 911 This elegant beauty of a Porsche model was owned by Steve McQueen himself. Its top speed, 125 miles per hour, was a little slower than some of its peers. It included a 2-liter V6 engine that could spit 158 horsepower, which was a significant boost from the previous 128. It could also sprint from 0 to 60 in 8.5 seconds, which was quite impressive in that light package. Number 6. The 1964 Aston Martin DB5 Sir Paul McCartney from The Beatles grabbed this Aston Martin masterpiece a few weeks after being recognized at Johnny Carson's Late Night, where they were officially introduced to the U.S. The interior of the original car was leather, which was delicately perched and adorned with musical notes from the company in his honor. There was a record player as well for listening to tunes on the go. The performance was brilliant too, as it could sprint from 0 to 60 in 7.5 seconds and achieve a maximum speed of 143 miles per hour. Number 5. The Toyota 2000 GT 1967 to 1970. The 2000 GT was Japan's first attempt at assembling a front mid engined car. Toyota retrieved the model, removed the roof, and created a convertible out of it with sufficient headroom. The car used a 2-liter and then a 2.3-liter that could deliver 150 horsepower. However, it came with a relaxed pace, accelerating from 0 to 60 in 12 seconds. Number 4. The 1968 Ferrari 365 GTB slash 4 Daytona The Ferrari 365 GTB was the Mira's top competitor. It was powered by a 4.4-liter V12 engine that helped it accelerate from 0 to 60 in 5.5 seconds. It could achieve 352 horsepower and a top speed of 174 miles per hour. Number 3. The 1963 Shelby Cobra Introduced in 1963, the Shelby Cobra introduced a new, ultra-compact design. The Cobra could easily achieve 500 horsepower with its 7-liter V8 engine and sprint from 0 to 60 in 4 seconds. It also had a top speed of 165 miles per hour. Number 2. The 1964 Ford GT40 With a 4.7-liter, 4.9-liter, and later a 7-liter V8 engine, the Ford GT40 could reach a top speed of 135 miles per hour. Without the chicanes, it was rumored that the car could very well reach 230 miles per hour top speed. It had an acceleration of 0 to 60 in 4 seconds 
thanks to its massive engine. After beating Ferrari four years in a row, Ferrari had to withdraw its factory teams until 1972. Number 1. 1966 Ferrari 275 GTB-4 The GTB-4 made its debut at the 1966 Paris Motor Show and became an instant sensation with sports car fanatics, particularly in the U.S. Considered one of the most attractive Ferrari Berlinettas of all time, this model was built by Scaglietti, featuring a new bodywork. Like the revolutionary 250 GTO, the model was adorned by big, circular headlamps integrated below the bulging plastic caps. The new wheels came with big, three-spoke center nut, while the side mirror was blended into the front fender. 